Hello everyone, and welcome to the next part in our Library 101 series, Chromebooks to Go. We are really excited about this new service, so let's jump in. If you are not familiar with Chromebooks, they are essentially laptops that are specifically for using the internet. The service Chromebooks to Go is exactly what it sounds like. You are able to check out a Chromebook laptop and bring it home to use. There are a few things you'll need before getting the Chromebook. First, you'll need an active Maricopa County Library District library card that belongs to an adult, so you do need to be over 18 to check one of these out. Additionally, because it is an internet browsing device only, you will want to make sure that you have access to a Wi-Fi connection so you can actually get on the internet. Lastly, you will need access to an outlet for charging the Chromebook. If you have never used a Chromebook, just think of it like a laptop, but its sole purpose again is to browse the internet. This is actually where a lot of things take place, so you can do your homework, job applications, shopping, email, online classes, social media, and everything on there, and more. If you are specifically worried about Microsoft programs, they do offer an internet-based suite that you can use. You just need to set up a Microsoft email account, and you will have access to those programs online. They do have slightly limited capabilities, but as far as I have used them, I really have not run into much trouble as far as what they can and cannot do. Additionally, if you are already comfortable using Google Docs, Slides, and Sheets, then this is a perfect alternative to Microsoft Word, Excel, and PowerPoint because the Chromebook logon requires your Gmail account, and if you already have Gmail, then you already have access to these programs. So to start, how it works. Let's say you decide that you want to check out a Chromebook. You can place a hold for it online or over the phone, but when it comes to picking the item up, you'll want to visit one of our branches and go to the help desk. Just let them know that you would like to pick up a held Chromebook or check to see if there are any available and they will help you out. The librarian will then go over the Chromebook kit with you and have you sign an understanding form. The kit will include a Chromebook, a charger, instructions, and a carrying case. You then get to check the kit out and you will have it for three weeks on your account. If no one is on the wait list once your three weeks is up, you can renew it for a total of five renewals. Once your borrowing period is over, bring the kit into the library and take it to the help desk. The library staff will check the item in and ensure all pieces of the kit are good and present. They will then wipe the Chromebook's memory and sanitize it for the next borrower. To use the Chromebook, make sure you are connected to the internet through a Wi-Fi connection. To do this, just click on the little Wi-Fi symbol. It will look a little bit like a fan. At this point, a little menu should appear. You will want to find the correct Wi-Fi that you want to connect to and you may have to enter a password. Now you are ready to log in. Click Let's Go to proceed. Here, you will just want to sign into your Gmail account and start browsing. If you do not have a Gmail account, you can use the guest mode from the previous screen and set one up, or you can browse as a guest for that session. Once you're in, feel free to browse the internet. If you need more specific help on using the Chromebook, you can visit support.google.com on a different device to find some answers. Additionally, you can call the library at 602-652-3000. The Chromebooks to Go program is part of the Connected at Your Library service. This service offers access to Chromebooks and hotspots for Wi-Fi at each of our branches. Thank you so much for joining us today, and I hope you'll check out a Chromebook soon. If you have any questions, please feel free to visit our website or give us a call at 602-652-3000. If you need more help, feel free to schedule a book a librarian appointment. You can get to the schedule page by typing in mcldaz.org help schedule. Have a great day. Bye.